Oh, yeah. I have warrants, man. Like a casual guy here, is that sure. right? When you see your lighting, your clothes won't even matter anymore. Yeah, you're, you're, you're looking, I'll, be in, you can't even I'll be the man in black. Plus, I'm, ba I'm behind the... I agree with you, I hear you. <laughs> Get her! I thought I'm <laughs> deaf, what did you say? Uh, I'll tell you later. Okay. It's bad, it's a secret. It it's it's be a, it'll be like, next time around, oh, I see. He's oh, Are my you done? goodness. Yes. Okay, Thank thanks. You. Oh, Sarah. Oh. Can I have a black? Are you ready? Oh, yes. Powder or cream? Yes, to your stuff that we might want to use in our video too. And I'll check yeah, this. Yeah. So you got both on both sides. Just to, I want as much content as we got the can. best makeup girl oh, here. Yeah. She's like a perfectionist. Well, means I might have to get the coffee. I zoomed in yet so you can see a little better. I wish you could have more wires. We don't want it to look messy. We don't want it to look too. Really? 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 Like a concert. Really? Yeah. Get back. Yeah. 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 Just to make it really We don't slip the floor a lot, but... Like, get back style, you know? Well, yeah, the next time around, it's, it's a great song we had. Uh, we recorded it a couple different times over the years, and uh, it, uh, at times, we, Pat and I were speaking about it, we don't, it's hard to tell what you've got when you've got it. Sometimes a few years have to go by when you look back and go, boy, that was a great song, because I love the song. Yeah, I do too. It's a, it's a really cool track. And uh, it really has all the elements that uh, we loved about Mr. Big, you know, there's some playing. But the groove is there, and Eric's singing his ass off. And it's, I think it's a great song for us now. Yeah, absolutely, because lyrically, it's, even though it was written 20 years ago, it's completely kind of describes the story of, of Mr. Big. It's, it's almost like we said before, it's like we planned it and we <laughs> didn't. And um, when, I, when I had heard it, after I hadn't heard it in a long time and listened to it again, I was thinking, this is unbelievable, this, the, the lyrics of the song, they, they, they're so meaningful yeah. as to the situation we're in right now. We're really happy with it. You know, I read a lot of love songs, and it just happens that this is almost, this is kind of a love song. I mean, uh, I love my brothers in the band. Uh, we're, uh, the lyrics work perfectly with our comeback, you know? And, um, and how we did, you know, you're in, a, you're in a band, and it's, you know, we're together 24-7 on a tour bus, jet airplanes, you know? Um, and, you know, building something up, and then, you know, we tear it down. I, you know, I'm, I'm definitely uh, using lyrics here, but it's the simplest way I could say it. Um, and it's only going to get better, and we're going to do we're going to do it right this time. <laughs> you know, I mean, we, you know, we can only hope. And uh, but I don't. I'm not thinking about it. I just like right now in the moment. I feel awesome.
<laughs> Feel the energy coming right off. Feel the love. Well. We represent the no, I'm talking about bad kids. Oh, we're not bad. Just working on it. When a hero comes along. Yes. Uh, you know, it's got the word blue. It's like they call it uh, Star Blue. Blue Star Star. Blue Marine. Blue Marine. Blue Marine, right? Okay. Break! 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 Well, I remember seeing Paul in Racer X in uh, Los Angeles. When I first got out there, he was playing Racer X. We'd go to the uh, Troubadour, sit in the front bar, and you guys would be playing in the big room in there. We could see you through the window. We'd always watch him, man. Just awesome, great playing. And I can remember Paul standing in front of me at a show in Pittsburgh. When as, I, as a fan. I remember it. I remember this one tall kid in the front, and that was you. And I remember this specific. Stealing all of the... Like, the funny thing, though, was, is in, in those days, you know, now everybody's got their camera phones. And yeah, right. In those days, all I had was my, my brain. Exactly. I would go to the show and just try to memorize everything you did. <laughs> and I would come home after the show and get up my guitar and try to you know, figure out what some of the things were. And... Years go by, yeah. we end up in a band together, and I mean, we were doing, um, I think we were working on some stuff ridiculous to that rush. And I'd come up with some ideas and I thought, well, this will this will be great because these are the licks that I stole from you. <laughs> so you'll already know them and we'll be able to just do it like that. And then I showed it to you and you're like, well, no, that's not the way I do it. Like, ah, damn, I figured it out wrong. Yeah. Which is good, though. Whenever yeah. you figure out something wrong, and now it becomes unique. It becomes your own lick. Your own lick. And you had a million of them. It's great. So yeah, working together like that, it's a lot of fun. It's a challenge. It's difficult, but once you get past the difficult part, it's just pure fun from then on. You know, we have a riot. It's pretty cool. Who else was Ringo? Who else was Ringo? Who else was Ringo? Or Green! <laughs> Shut down. Shut down. It's a wrap, people. Oh, there's a lot of secrets, and we're not telling. <laughs> well, to me, I'm excited about just putting in some time to prepare for it. Yeah. Um, I, remember, I, I remember the standard that we set in the old days, and you know, going back and watching a lot of the footage of the old live concerts, seeing the, the stuff we did, not just the songs, but the crazy instrumental stuff yeah. we did. And, uh, and just the, the energy of us, you know, playing these relatively difficult songs yeah. and jumping around, While kicking around, around. and, uh, you know, to make sure we do that and more. Exactly. Sort of yeah, we set the standards high for ourselves, you know, we, we make it so that we got to be, in order to do our show, we, we got to be really on. We can't, we can't really, that's why we've never been much of a drinking band, not during the show, because we could never do that <laughs> stuff if we were out of it a little bit, but uh, so we set the, the standard high, but we do it for a reason, you know, because we really care about what we do. We want it to be good. We want it to be good for people paying the hard-earned cash to come see us play, so it's an important thing. Some cool stuff. Hi. <laughs> okay.